Guys, before coming to question number one, I want to tell you about my tips. My first tip is always read the statement at least two times. And my second tip is try to find the given data. And with the help of your data, you can easily find out the useful formula for calculation of unknown data. Let's read this uh, question and uh, try to apply our tips in here. The current flowing into the base of transistor is 100 micro A. Find the collected current, the emitted current, and the ratio IC by IE if the value of current gain beta is 100. Let's read this statement again. The current flowing into the base of transistor is 100 mu A. Find the collected current, the emitted current, and the ratio of collector to emitter is the value of trend gain, I mean beta is 100. Let's find out the data from this statement, which is my second tip. Trend flowing through base IV is 100 micro ampere. Micro means 10 to power minus 6. Trend gain, that is my next data, which is equal to 100 and it is represented with beta. When the unknown quantities are collected current IC, emitted current IE, and ratio of collected to emitted current IC divided by IE, these are unknown data, uh, I mean unknown uh, uh, values of unknown uh, variables, and these uh, are given data. Let's choose a useful formula according to this uh, demand. If I see the first formula is useful for calculation of IC because I have the beta as well as IB. I mean trend flowing through the base. Mm, for the next uh, unknown data, I mean IE, this one is helpful for me because already I have IB and I will calculate IC from first part. I mean with the help of this formula, formula number one. Well, for the ratio of collected to emitter friend, simply divide IC by IE. Let's uh, apply this strategy in uh, here and find and try to find out the unknown data. Formula number one for calculation of collected friend IC is equal to beta multiplied with IB. IB is equal to 100. I mean 13. Multiply with IB. IB is 100 into 10 to the power of minus. Then I multiply these quantities. I get 10 into 10 to the power of minus 3 ampere or 10 milliampere. I know that 10 to the power of minus 3 is equal to milli. So that is collector cran. Let's use formula number 2 for calculation of emitter current. Pressure is ready. I see which is equal to 10 milliampere. I calculate it in first part. 10 into 10 to the power minus 3 plus IB which is 100 into 10 to the power minus 6 ampere. Application I get 10.1 into 10 to the power minus 3 ampere or IE is equal to 10.1 milliampere that is answer of second part I mean emitter current for ratio simply divide IC by IE see this is my equation number one and this is my equation number two so IC divided by IE is equal to 10 milliampere divided by 10.1 milliampere. After simplification, simply I get 0 0.999. So that is collected to emitter ratio. Let's move to next problem and you can find solution of next problem in my next video.